Agents with the Oklahoma Bureau of Narcotics tells us that this investigation has led them to eight overdoses. Six of those are fatalities. We believe that eight number, the number of eight overdoses right now is going to end up climbing. Mark Woodward with OBN says it was early May when his office began their investigation involving two people who overdosed and died in central Oklahoma after purchasing fake oxycodone, later determined to be fentanyl. This fentanyl powder could be 10 times to 100 times to even 10 thousand times stronger uh, than than heroin. He says the fake pills sold on the black market. We don't believe most of these dealers or the users even know that there's fentanyl in it. He says those pills are stamped to resemble a common U.S. brand. We have seen some side by side. You couldn't tell the difference. Woodward says the distribution far reaching from Oklahoma to both the east and west coasts. He says three people have been arrested and hundreds of fake oxycodone pills are now off the streets. But he believes there are more people involved. So that's why our agents are continuing to comb the state, work with our law enforcement partners and the medical examiner, because we believe that eight number, that number of eight overdoses right now is going to end up climbing. Katrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.